On the night of September 7, 1996, Tupac attended the Mike Tyson vs. Bruce Seldon boxing match at the MGM Grand in Las Vegas, Nevada. After the event, he was involved in a scuffle with a Crips gang member at the hotel. Later that evening, while Tupac was riding in a car with Death Row Records CEO Suge Knight, a white Cadillac pulled up alongside them at a stoplight, and an unknown assailant fired multiple shots at the vehicle. Tupac was hit several times and sustained critical injuries. Tupac was taken to the hospital, where he underwent multiple surgeries. Despite efforts to save him, he succumbed to his injuries on September 13, 1996. Las Vegas Metropolitan Police Department LVMPD, conducted an investigation into the shooting, but they faced numerous challenges, including a lack of cooperation from witnesses and potential intimidation within the rap community. The crime scene did not yield conclusive evidence, and the identity of the shooter remained elusive. Over the years, various individuals and groups have been suggested as potential suspects in Tupac's murder. Some theories have implicated rival gang members, associates of the notorious B.I.G., and even corrupt law enforcement officers. However, no concrete evidence has been presented to definitively link anyone to the crime. Numerous conspiracy theories have emerged, suggesting that Tupac's murder was orchestrated by powerful figures in the music industry or law enforcement due to his activism and outspokenness about social and political issues.